Welcome folks. Today we are grilling bone marrow. You're going to set your grill up for indirect heat, uh, looking at a temperature of 350 to 450. We're using oak chunks for some smoke. You want to get your hands on some split marrow bones. So this bag was five bucks, bread was two bucks. That's what we call affordable decadence. Now your grill time is going to be between 15 and 25 minutes. You're going to want to start checking the bones after 15 minutes because there's a real tight time window between cooked and that marrow melting right out of the bones. So you're looking for this mesmerizing, sizzling, bubbling marrow and now it's time to get the bones off the grill. You can hold them in a warm oven while we grill up some bread. For the bread, I'm just going to uh, drizzle some olive oil right on top. And then it's time to make it rain rosemary. Just don't try this at the gentlemen's clubs. It will definitely get you banned for life. All right, so the bread we're going to want to grill directly over the coals. And this is going to be fast. So we're thinking 30 to 45 seconds per side. Uh, we're just looking for some light grill marks, and then it's time to flip the bread uh, and take it off the grill. All right, now that the bread's done, grab your bones, a butter knife, and should your dainty, uncalloused hands need it, an oven mitt to hold the bones because they're hot, damn it! Magic time is here. You scrape that beautiful nectar right out of that bone onto your grilled bread and get ready. And to finish this beautiful dish, uh, grab yourself some Fleur de Sel French finishing salt and uh, you're just going to uh, sprinkle it on these beautiful pieces of bread and marrow. Uh, I find that this dish pairs really well with a uh, lightly chilled burgundy uh, or about seven beers. Trust me, make this dish. Do not live your life full of regrets.